can see this is uh, HMI control Arduino via Modbus TCPI. Actually, I am not using Arduino. I am using ESP8266 uh, module like this. Uh, and that module is there exactly. You can see here. Uh, I put some LED, uh, one white, uh, red, yellow, blue, another green and last one also white. Okay. You can see my LED are here. Okay. Uh, here the HMI connected with the Ethernet cable. This is the Ethernet cable. I show you the back side. You see the Ethernet cable. Okay. This is the description of my HMI. You can see here it's showing the temperature of the system temperature. I have marked here. You getting from this uh, box. This box. Uh, that uh, module connected via Wi-Fi to the home network and uh, this HMI also connected via Ethernet to my home network so if I press LED 1 you can see there is one LED glow okay I put it off you see okay you see here on and also here on the screen is on you see LED one is on so I I make it off is off now I'm going to press LED 2 you will see the LED 2 is the LED 2 okay LED 2 is red and the same indication also you can find here so here yeah. LED 3 is yellow you can see here yellow light and here you can see in the yellow LED okay and uh, now LED 4 I put here LED 4 here you can find LED 4 is blue and here you can see there is blue light on, blue LED on. okay so I put it off again I put LED 5 here you can see the green LED and here also green so put it off now the parameter I put some uh, analog uh, value I am giving here value for example 1 2 3 and uh, press enter you see I read the value via controller so this value goes to my controller the controller sending the value here okay if I put here something randomly four eight five six three and enter okay it is reached the uh, because it's a maximum six six thousand so uh, five eight six three okay enter you see 5863 so here analog 3 if I put some 325 325 and this is analog 4 if I put something 859 you see he's reading the value 859 and uh, here last one is 212365 enter you see six five this analog five i let with one led light so you can see there the last one is glowing if i put it uh, zero then this light could should be go off so i put it zero here zero enter you see value zero and now you see the light goes off okay and here this is the live temperature of the system okay okay now I stop this HMI okay you see I see also HMI again I am going to start my SCADA system so this is my computer okay I put password I have a SCADA system here 
yes okay just a little bit yeah spin up here you see so here i have the same screen i prepared here this is the scala system and the same controller is there you see okay so first one i put led one it's white you see the light goes white okay now led2 it's red you see the light goes red now led3 is uh, yellow you see here yellow so again here another two led led4 blue as you can see here the blue light okay now the last one is uh, green okay green so here also green okay now same the analog value i can put here two five eight you see here two five eight second analog value i put here six nine three you can you see six nine three the third analog value i put here one two three six you see one two three six again here two five eight nine two five eight nine and this is the value and this is belongs to this led last one so if i give here the analog value 100 enter you see the light glowing very 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 less okay now the maximum value for example i give here 3000 3000 the light glow little high okay 50 percent so now here i put the maximum value 6000 6000 you see the light is flow so that device has one controller like same what i show you here uh, esp8266 and uh, it can controlling my scada system on the pc and also my so friends uh, the main thing is i can con con uh, control that uh, module this module from both place from my scada and from my hmi so just i give a small demo uh, here if i press led one so you can see the led one is on okay and here also you find led one is on you see led one is on okay now led two is on so you can see led two is on and here led two is on okay if i press from here led three is on then you see here led three is on and here also same time led3 is on you see and uh, here led4 is on and you see the led4 is on here and same thing here you see led4 is on if i put uh, led5 is on and you see the led5 is on and here led5 is on okay so temperature if you see both places the temperature are same 33.500 and here also 33 33 75 or something like same here changed every time it's changed okay so that's it so the main thing is this uh, arduino controller here esp8266 controller i can control from both place from my scada from my hmi at the same time with same network connection i don't need to change anything and you see the value is here also i use uh, 
machine approved for programming you can see this is my sketch and machine pro is the best programming for arduino controller arduino esp anything you can program so i use modbus you can see it is modbus and modbus server tcp protocol tcp protocol and this is tcp server so you can use machine pro for programming the arduino controller or usb controller anything or you can execute the same thing so thank you for watching thank you